score. Not 25 as advertised. 20 lap point score for the A Raiders. Looks like Simon Flynn is doing a... No, Simon Flynn is doing a 20 lap point score. He just happened to miss the start and is trying to catch up. I wasn't sure, I thought he might have been doing a 19 lap point score at that early stage. But good work from Flynn. Getting his legs hard enough for that first sprint that's going to come. Carlo Ciccelli, I'm expecting big things from you in this A-grade sprint race. So, Dwayne Johansson, Thomas Unicum, Darren Hill, Dan Hayes, Carlo Ciccelli, Hamish Goda, Simon Flint back in with the bunch. Very, very nasty warm-up that was. So they do get the belt, Thomas Unicum is leading this one out. Darren Hill having the big look over the shoulder, as is Dan Hayes. Five points up for grab this time around. Hamish Goat doesn't care what big names are in this race. He just wants to get out and go for it. Thomas Unicum makes his way to the line. Darren Hill in there as well. So Thomas Unicum takes the five, Hill for three. Ciccelli for two points, Hamish Goat for one. That is how they go through with 15 laps to go. So I need to make an apology for tearing up Veronica. Your name was on the list but did not make it through. So I tell you what, the pace is certainly on. Thomas Unicum keeping it up along with Hamish Goda. These guys are absolutely flying. Well, I might have mentioned last week, but over in the Nationals, in the Adelaide Speedo, there was an absolutely fantastic picture of Darren Hill blasted up on the wall with another, all the other great champions the whole way around as you enter into that velodrome. It it's, uh, makes the hair stand up on the back of your neck, seeing all these great champions along the lines of O'Grady and Darren Hill. And the senior side racing back in now, we are absolutely blessed. Amish Goda leads this one out as they take the bell, half race distance. And you can see Hamish Goda still on his restricted gears. Thomas Unicum now takes a run on the outside. Dwayne Johansson in the mix for points. And so is Simon Flynn. So awesome to see Dwayne Johansson in the points once again. So Dan Hayes trying to get a bit of that back, back out of those legs so that he can contest the next sprint. Dwayne Johansson, it's been a while since this young man's been contesting the points in a points race, but great to see. So they've got seven laps this time around. No one too keen to do anything too much. And all of the guys just fairly keen to recover at this stage. And they definitely don't want to let that one go. I didn't want to call it too early. But Dan Hayes unleashes from the back of the bunch, drops down. And Hayes go to have a look at that. Those young legs just take off and leave the old boy standing. 
name is Yoda, is absolutely motoring, throwing your hands and trying to come at him. Thomas Unica boxed in on the inside, but here comes your hands and then he will take five points. He is getting excited, this guy. He's thinking, I am back in a points race and at the pointy end of it. And A grade as well, I might add. So Dwayne O'Hanson now puts himself up in the points. Thomas Unicum and Hamish Schroeder, Simon Flynn, Carlo Ciccelli. Bit light on points is Carlo Ciccelli at this stage, but it's a great effort nevertheless to be up in A grade. Thomas Unicum leading the bike race on 12 points, but Dwayne Johansson currently second on seven. Hamish Goda is third on six points. So it will come down to this final sprint between Dwayne Johansson and Hamish Goda. And Simon Flynn has something to say about that as well. And he is gone, and he is gone early. So Thomas Unicum leading the way so far on points on 12. They get the bell. Amy Strode is going on with it. Thomas Unicum looks very composed. Dwayne Johansson will wind that bike up from the back. And have a look at that. Dwayne Johansson trying to come around. Thomas Unicum is the winner of your bike race. And Dwayne Johansson will take second place on points.